That looks cool. Uh -huh. If you come here and look at it. Wow. I'll look at it a little bit closer, but. The surround, there's nothing really in the surrounding area this elaborate. Nothing. It's all in one spot. So if you take a look around. Where this tree limb has snapped off, the upper part is remaining and the lower part is maybe somewhere on the ground. Maybe. I don't know which tree branch it would have been. But half of it's hanging. Most all the trees that are part of the structure have no bark. Yeah, there's bark missing on these trees. And we heard a whistle prior to prior to coming in on it. But I, you know, I would say, well, you know, there could be hikers in this area. But I just walked through this. It was difficult to walk through. So unless there's a, a person just, you know, didn't want to be seen and got off the road, you know? There's nothing in the whole surrounding area elaborate like this at all. Not nowhere near this elaborate of what created the, this focal point of all that apex. We'll call it the braided apex. This is the cool stuff that I like. Yes. Seeing the interesting things like this. Who's whistling? Okay. We're here at Expedition Bigfoot, so let's go on inside and have a look. Sign says more exhibits. We've got a bunch of new stuff set up in there for you guys to check out, including our working laboratory and our Florida Skunk Ape exhibit. For you guys are going to get to check out. That's from Paul Freeman. Yeah. Hold on, let me get a little zoom. Right now, there's a yeah. <laughs> That's cool. My hands are full. It's already filming. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> Gosh, I That's right, Ty, you're the newbie. You can mm. listen. <laughs> it's awesome, right? It's very good. It's, it's pretty interesting in this here. This museum is um, very informative. I'm very impressed with it. A lot of stuff. Um, he's He's and I think people should stop by. And it's yes, in yes, he's done. He's done his homework. It's um, he's he's got it full. A lot of audio, and um, it's a very good museum. Yes, if and you're ever in, if you're ever in this area, yeah, stop. Yeah, Blue Ridge, Georgia. Yes, stop by and take a look. Yeah, yeah David done. He's done a lot of hard work in putting yeah. this place together. It's a lot of um, a lot of detail. I'll say that. It's very interesting to look at. 
and it's really set up like um, you know like where you're actually seeing like expedition gear and the actual gear uh, the researchers will use and things like that. It's, so, it's very like, neat. Yeah, and it's like little. Um, so I'm part of what you would think it, you'd see at Disney World. It's I mean, like that stations. type of quality. It's like little stations that are unique to each research from other people. Um, it's not like just a bunch of stuff thrown together. Each little area has a, like a sighting or house or footage or a theme or, or a set yes, like themed yes, areas. It's, it's own through. little theme, mm -hmm. own little story. Yeah. Yeah, we like it. Thumbs up. Yeah.